Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of Evans Eats. Got a new camera rig I'm trying tonight. Um, so, I've been craving potato soup for a while now, and I decided that tonight is the night. It's going down, so let's get started. Pretty basic ingredients for this. Um, so first off, we'll go through that. I've got a couple cups of water, some chicken stock, some garlic. I've also got a couple 12 ounce cans of evaporated milk. I've got an onion. You can use Velveeta. I like this stuff. It's from Aldi, and honestly, it tastes better than Velveeta because Velveeta is just kind of crap anymore. And then you can add whatever you want, bacon, I've got some ham I'm going to cook up and throw into mine. And I've got some green onion. And obviously, you're going to need the star of the show. The potato. The spud. First thing we're going to do... <laughs> Andy's really excited about her new puzzle. Uh, first thing we're going to do is peel these potatoes. I'm not going to go into too much detail about that. I'm sure all of you know how to peel a potato, so. This is actually my peeler from culinary school. It's still going strong. Isn't that just crazy? Alright, so we got all those peeled up. I peeled about Seven to eight decent little sized potatoes, probably medium sized potatoes. We're gonna go ahead and get our onion cleaned up. And again, I know that most of you, if not all of you, know how to clean up an onion, so we're going to skip this as well. Now, to cut this, you can do it in any array that you want, but I'm gonna French mine. So you just cut it up and get those little slivers. And that's what you want. So I'm going to do this for the rest of that and we'll move on to the next part. And since we got all that done, we'll set these aside. Right, so we got all these chopped up. So now we'll go ahead and move over to our pot and get the soup cracking. Alright, so I've got it on medium heat and into that. Add a little bit of olive oil. That oil is nice and hot. It's rippling. Oh, hello. <laughs> How do you do? We're going to go ahead and throw in onions. And we're going to saute those up for a few minutes. And while I'm cooking these onions, I'm throwing about half a teaspoon of dried thyme. I'm stirring it, I'm stirring it, I'm stirring it well. Once our onions have started to soften up, and a nice little tablespoon of garlic. And once you see that these have started to cook down, starting to turn a little translucent, I think we're good. Go ahead and add in our chicken stock. And also, my evaporated milk. Started to get ahead of myself. We want to open our evaporated milk. We don't want to put those in quite yet. So, 
Oh yeah, I'm just a klutz. I haven't done a video in a long time, and it shows. I almost poured the potato water in here. All right. So, we've got our potatoes in there. I'm gonna turn it up to like a medium high. And now what we're gonna do is cook these until they're tender. Potatoes are almost where we need them to be, so we'll now go ahead and season. A teaspoon of salt. And if I can get to it. There we go. About half a teaspoon of black pepper. Stir that through, and then once these potatoes are where we want them to be, we'll add our evaporated milk and our cheese, and let it melt through, and then we'll be looking pretty good. Okay, potatoes are good, so we're going to go ahead and add in our evaporated milk. We'll mix that through. I got dog. And we'll add in our 20 pounds of cheese. Now we're just going to mix this through, let all that cheese melt, let it simmer for probably another 10 15 minutes, let everything finish coming together, and then we're going to serve this bad boy. All right, I did a final taste test on that, and I ended up adding another teaspoon of garlic powder, onion powder, and salt, and it's like pretty well perfect. So we're going to use. Green onion, scallion, what have you. I'm gonna chop this up to, to garnish it. <clears throat> All right. I was gonna crisp up some of the sand, but I'm being lazy, so we let the soup warm it up. Oh, oh damn! Huh? It's little. The ham? Yeah. Big chunks for like eight dollars a bag. It's stupid. Anyway, um. <laughs> mm. yes. The soup. I like the crackers in mine too, but we little bit of sour cream and some chivies. Little burn my mouth test. Mm. Mm. That was right. Please. The things I do for you people. Mm. Okay. That is delicious though. Creamy, cheesy, very comforting, which is what you want, especially in the cold weather. So, go ahead and give it a try. If you have your own variation, let me know in the comments. Let me know what you guys do. Um, if you do give this one a try, let me know. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you later.